in this part of the White Files, we visit the Roebuck Inn in Berkshire to find out about a rather mischievous ghost. But first, the true dramatized story of a fisherman whose soul wouldn't rest until his body was found. James Chambers was an enthusiastic fisherman who would go angling whenever he had time off his busy work schedule. But one day, he simply vanished without a trace. Mrs. Chambers was inconsolable. Her husband had disappeared without a trace. And if he was alive, where was he? And if he was dead, how could she lay him to rest without a body? Kenneth Watts was a keen weekend fisherman, always on the lookout for new places to catch his favorite fish, pike. How do you do? Lovely do? day for it. Yeah, yeah. What exactly are you after? Well, pike. Ah. Well, if it's pike you want, you want to be further down river. There's a jolly good spot. I can show you if you like. I think it's not too much trouble. No trouble at all. This way. Okay. This is the spot. Oh, yeah. Hey, cheers. the body was identified as James Chambers, who'd fallen into the river after suffering a heart attack. Photographs shown to Kenneth convinced him that he was the man who'd taken him along the river to where his own body lay. Mrs. Chambers could finally lay her husband to rest and find peace within herself.